A rescue operation is underway in Turkey after an American cave explorer fell ill and became trapped more than 3,000 feet underground. But some good news emerged on Friday. Officials said 40-year-old Mark Dickey's condition is stabilizing as more than 150 rescuers from Turkey and other countries raced to save him. Tulga Shener is the head of the Rescue Commission Medical Unit. Mark's health condition is stable now. Uh, his vital signs are uh, normal. All of them are normal. No uh, breathing problems, no pulse problem, no rhythm problem, no vomiting. And uh, till that day, we gave uh, four units of blood cell solution to him and also some medications for his stomach and for uh, his general condition. Hi, uh, Mark Dickey from nearly a thousand meters. Dickey was on an international exploration mission in the Morka Cave in the Taurus Mountains when he began suffering from gastrointestinal bleeding while underground. In a video message, Dickey described his situation while thanking rescuers for working to get him out. So I don't quite know what's happened, but um, I do know that um, the quick response of the Turkish government to get the medical supplies that I needed, uh, in my opinion, saved my life. Um, I was very close to the edge when Jessica got back to me. Um, as you can see, I'm up, I'm alert, I'm talking, uh, but I'm not healed on the inside yet, so I'm going to need a, a lot of help to get out of here. Footage from the operation showed rescuers setting up camp outside the cave sinkhole, Turkey's third largest. According to the head of search and rescue for Turkey's Afad Disaster Management Authority, the operation to bring Dickey out could take days.